It's high school basketball season. It's that time of year. We get to see some parents freak out at the refs, but uh, it's not always parents. Sometimes it happens to be former NBA legends like Matt Barnes. We all know the legend, Matt Barnes. He was famous for being in that video where Kobe didn't flinch, but he doesn't play basketball anymore. He's not in front of crowds anymore, so... He has to do some outside-of-the-box thinking to come up with ways for people to notice him. Today, he's chosen a tactic that many normal parents have tried in the past, and that is to scream at the refs or the coach. I'm not really sure who he's screaming at in this video. Let's take a look. So this is the original clip that was posted. You gotta love the Twitter rage bait. They posted this video, but conveniently cut out the part where the kid told him to shut up. Probably because it doesn't exist. Joke's on them though, this whole game was live streamed and recorded, uh, but even that was cut up a bit, so I think they stopped the live stream (laughs) when the confrontation happened, but we have the before and the after. Working, Barnes had a bit of a flop, there's no whistle, instead Perry gets fouled. Crowds didn't really like that one. Barnes had some choice words for the ref after the no call on the flop. And that's a technical. Yeah, I do. Mean, yeah. Uh, and I think. Well, so he technical on Barnes, but he also said he gave one to Fisher, maybe. I'm not sure. Wow. But. And then. Oh, wow. Well. Matt Barnes now is out onto the floor, or not on the floor, he's right on the side of the floor, just screaming you're an ex- expletive. Oh my god. To, uh, Jake, I have never seen <laughs> I mean, I've never seen anything like this right now. I mean, <laughs> that's ridiculous. He's out onto the floor right now, and just no one's doing anything about it. I get he's an NBA player, uh, but I mean, at a certain point, like, well, what? I mean, I don't... I don't think that's, yeah. Well, that's, 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 I mean, that's, let me tell you, the original call might have been a little weak, but that's in their technical. No, I think both, I, I heard what Barnes said to the ref, his son, that, uh, excuse me, number 20, uh, Carter said to the ref, I, I, I don't blame the official for teeing him up. I, I, I can't repeat that on the broadcast or else I might be uh, spending a day home from school, Bill. Barnes. He was fully out on the court, Jake, while they were shooting that yeah, free throw. I mean, he was, his feet were onto the actual court. Oh, that's, that's pretty crazy. I mean, you don't see that too often. Um, all right, so unclear whether or not Coach Fisher also got a technical. It's tough to focus because Matt Barnes keeps screaming. I still it's, right um, it's unclear if Coach Fisher also got a technical or not. But we do know that uh, Carter Barnes picked up a tap. Hamenya can't hit. It's loose. So that clip, that was the build up to it. And they guess they stopped the feed when the confrontation happened. And then this is him starting up again. All right, we're back. Um, the, Matt Barnes kind of came up and just put his short hands on me, actually. So, oh, I mean, I'm all good, but I, it's kind of, I don't know. This crowd is just, this, yeah. This is almost insane. Um, it might be suspended. Yeah, I don't, I mean, I don't know. Security's out on the floor, so I don't know. Um, but they're gonna. They're, I mean, they're stopping the game. I think we're gonna take a break. You don't really hear the kids say anything wrong. Uh, You don't hear Matt Barnes say anything either. 
It was not caught on the feed, but the kid did give his account after the game. Uh, He said, Matt Barnes kind of came up and just put his hands on me. So, I mean, I'm all good, but it's kind of, I don't know. This guy was on the court mid-game and multiple times screaming ridiculous stuff at the refs. And everyone, including myself, was looking at him. Yeah, we saw that. I mean, he's he sticks out a little bit when he's on the court screaming. We made eye contact, and that was enough for him to come up to me and grip my shoulder. Oh boy, Matt Barnes, he, he's on a power trip. High school basketball game. He found his his target. Uh, a high school kid announcing the game. That's that's great, Matt. That's great. He said, "What do you think you're looking at?" And I said, "You're screaming. You're a bad word to the refs mid game while I'm trying to announce. Don't touch me." And then he said, "I'll slap the shit out of you." So that's the kid's account of the game. Matt Barnes, he weighs in as well with the tweet. This guy was getting so emotional on the court. Then he switches to Twitter. Oh, man. Shut your ass up. I was talking to the ref, not you or that kid that decided to say some slick shit. Oh, no. Oh, no, Matt Barnes. He said some slick shit to you. Oh, no. Oh, don't let that privileged HW shit go to your head. I don't care who your son is. Well, nobody cares about your son either, Matt. That's pretty clear. Uh, The announcer guy, the announcer high school kid, has now gotten more press than your son has. I know we didn't get the exact encounter on video, but, you know, who who do you tend to believe? The the nerdy high school kid announcer who's just happy to be there? (laughs) Or the uh, former NBA player who's... He's a dick. He, <laughs> I don't think too many people like Matt Barnes. Um, I'm not even sure, but who get the guy literally on the court of a high school basketball game getting emotional while his son's team is getting destroyed. They're getting destroyed. This guy's getting emotional over his son's basketball game. I don't know. I, it's kind of tough to believe somebody like that. Whenever the emotions get involved, it gets a little tricky. Uh, but like slick shit. What, what does that even mean? That could mean anything. That is so vast. Like that is the most vague statement I've ever heard. I mean, you got one person who comes out and says, yeah, this is exactly what was said and what happened. And the other gave vague details, um, and said, I wasn't even talking to him, dude. We got video of you with your hand on his shoulder. His hands are like up. He's like threatened by you. And like, you can't even read this. Like, You know, if you weren't trying to threaten somebody and like somebody gets all like defensive, you'd be like, oh, sorry, man. Like, I'm not trying to come at you here. This kid is like scared and you're like sitting there enjoying it. It's, it's weird, man. It's weird. These, these guys could still go to high school basketball games and yell. So you'll be fine. You'll be fine, man. That's going to be for this video. It's been your boy, J-Dog. Hit the like button, comment and subscribe. This is either a comeback or you won't see me for months. I'm out.